U.S. of Congress APC, has called on Digbo to beware of restructuring the seat of the presidential candidate of the People Democratic Party PDP, Ataiku Abu Bakr, National Publicity Secretary, Lan Reisa O'Neill who made this call at a press conference in Abuja said there is need to protect the sanctity of the nationhood. According to him, with a few members of Ahonis falling for Ataiku's antics, saying that the purported endorsement of Ataiku's presidential ambition does not enjoy the support of most of the Igbos. He urged Digbo and all Nigerians to be wary of Ataiku and his PDP Oku in their desperate quest for power are ever ready to play fraudulent political games and parade themselves as ethnic champions to the gullible. He also alleged that few people in Ahonese are trying to misrepresent the interest of Ndigbo, saying that these people are part of Ataiku's friends that he has promised to make rich as a cardinal policy of his government. The National Publicity Secretary said that the ruling APC remained the most sincere political platform working to ensure better inclusion and mainstreaming of all geopolitical zones in the governance of the country. Besides the deceitful restructuring promise, what else do the Indigo stand to gain from an Antigua's presence? Nothing. Could it be that Atiku and the PDP restructuring rhetoric is selective and bespoke of for specific audiences? The answer is yes. Atiku's restructuring rhetoric is simply a convenient, simplistic, and populist gimmick aimed at wiping up and exploit perceived sentiments ahead of the 2019 general elections. Undigo, and indeed all Nigerians, must be wary of Atiku and his PDP earth, who in their desperate quest for power are ready to play fraudulent political games and parade themselves as ethnic champions to the gullible. We must protect the sanctity 